With your local area news this morning, I'm Justin Mott. Good morning to everyone. In Panola County, Jeffrey Mickens, age 47 of Carthage, was arrested on the charges of murder, kidnapping, aggravated assault, and attempted murder of a peace officer. And here in Shelby County, some information from the Shelby County Sheriff's Office. Uh, You may want to use caution if you're headed down FM 417 East and 2694. There's a possibility that the roads may be washed out or flooded. Also... An update on schools. All area schools will be open today according to their websites. Once again, all area schools for Shelby County and St. Augustine County will be open today according to their websites. Jury duty cancellation. If you received a jury summons for Monday, February the 26th for the 273rd District Court, you no longer need to report. The jury has been canceled. Once again, the jury that was scheduled for Monday, February the 26th for the 273rd District Court has been canceled. The City of Tenaha is going to have a City Council meeting on February the 26th at 5.15 p.m. Coming up in St. Augustine, the St. Augustine Lions Club is going to have a sporting clay shoot on Saturday, March the 3rd at the Fairway Farm. The fee is $100 per shooter, and for more information, you can call 275-6015. That's 936-275-6015. In your rest report in Shelby County, Ahmad Chambly, 27, a center, delivery of marijuana, possession of a controlled substance, abandoning and endangering a child. No new arrests were reported from San Augustine County this morning. And in obituaries, Bronice McDonald Curtis, age 87, passed away peacefully in her sleep. Visitation will take place Friday, February the 23rd from 6 to 8 p.m. at the Watson and Sons Funeral Home. Funeral service will take place this Saturday at 11 a.m. with Brother Mike Foge and Brother B.A. Morris officiating. Interment will follow at the Wimberley Cemetery in Huxley. She is survived by a host of family and friends. Freddie Barnes Jr., 68, passed away recently. Services will take place this Saturday in St. Augustine with Tony Barnes officiating. Burial will follow at the Mosaic Cemetery in St. Augustine. Miss Doris Loggins, age 92, passed away recently. Services are pending at this time. 85-year-old Jack G. Yates of Center passed away on Tuesday the 20th. Visitation took place yesterday. Funeral services will be held today at 2 p.m. at the Watson & Sons Chapel with Brother Todd Jenkins and Brother Glenn Jones officiating. Interment will follow at the Oak Lawn Memorial Park. He survived by a host of family and friends. 59-year-old Robert Allen Thompson of Carthage passed away recently. Services will take place today at 2 p.m. at the Mangum Funeral Home with Reverend Randy Smith officiating. Interment will follow at the Rama Cemetery. He is survived by a host of family and friends. Moye Men of Center passed away on the 19th. Services will take place this Saturday at the Mangum Funeral Home at 1 p.m. Visitation will be held this Saturday from 12 noon to 1 at the Mangum Funeral Home. Services for 73-year-old Alice Grace of Hemphill will take place Saturday at 1 p.m. at the Macedonia Baptist Church in Hemphill with Pastor Joe Gilbert officiating. Bear will follow in the Macedonia Cemetery. Visitation will be held today from 1 to 6.30 p.m. at the Gardner & Sons Chapel. In weather, 56 degrees and cloudy. This has been Justin Mott with your local and area news.